What's going on guys, Phil here from Custom Offsets, Custom Offsets TV and then YouTube with... Oh, so now this time you're not gonna say gotcha. it, but you did last time. This is Junior. <laughs> uh, typically we'd have an episode of From the Gallery coming up today. You told but, me this is From the Gallery. Well, it sort of is. This time we're featuring uh, a handful of our ambassadors. So oh. the people that have signed up on the website, customoffsets.com forward slash ambassador, you know, type in all their stuff. And then they basically, you know, earn credit towards products when they share our stuff. So. We figured we'd shout a couple of those guys out. So I'm gonna open up the old Instagram and we're gonna run through these. Starting off with that leveled 5.3, Jacob Nichols. This is his truck. See now it's, I don't have like all of the specs in front of me so I can only say it's a 14 to 18 Chevy 1500. No, it's a 14 to 15. Oh, okay, I suppose, because they had the refresh of the front end. But yeah, we'll just scroll through a couple of these pictures and kind of get an idea what's going on here. What wheels are those? I don't know, but they're awesome. Oh, I got the inside painted, got some exhaust There's going on. Oh boy, here we go. I just wanted to, see. I thought I was gonna show his wheels more, but maybe not. No, it's exhaust. Nice. Okay, I've heard of 5.3 before. <laughs> train horns, nice, interesting. I hate train interesting. horns. Why? We put them on the Archon truck. Right. Isn't that you? Why? No, I did not put those on it. I mean, banker. yeah, but it's your truck. No, it's the banker. It's the Archon truck. truck. Mm -hmm. It's got some wheel lights. I still I can't like figure out what Whoa. those are. I think they're XFs. Look at the X. Oh yeah, the See, XF, XF, XF nice. off-road. I dig it. All right, have you seen enough for a number? Yeah. Give it an, oh God, oh no, what happened? Did you just happened? kill your iPad? <sighs> oh, oh, pretend good. that didn't happen. Uh, give it a rating back. in three, two, one, seven. eight. Seven. One with a seven? Because um, I don't like the way that the, like, the new extended cab looks, because it's not the full Four doors. See, I like it better than the extended cabs that existed before, though. So you're, that's you're not going to off because it's a double cab? Is that yeah, it? that's true. It does look better than the extended cabs. Yeah, I thought this was a smart thing for a Chevy to do, just to get out of the extended cab life yep. and get into, like, this. But otherwise, I do really like those wheels on there. I think they look pretty sharp. Yeah. I haven't seen them very much either, so it's not, like, a super common setup. It no. looks like he uses it a little bit, too. Yeah, and it's, uh, he's only got, like, a three-inch leveling kit on here, and then I would say those look like, what do you think, 12 wides? 12 wides Probably 20, 20, 20s or 22s? 22s. Probably 22s, pretty thin sidewall. We're completely guessing here because we don't have the specs. specs. Um, but I think it looks pretty sharp, other than other than the whole extended cab thing. Yeah, you'll get over it, you're small. Oh, nice. <laughs> Next, Michael Ramirez. You'll, you'll come in game. Name? 16, is, it, is that the name though. of his truck? Sure. 16 V? That? For 16 valve, like is it 16 valve, like, you know, 12 valve, Barbara 24 Jean? valve. Is it 16 valve a thing though? I don't know. I think you made that up. That's what it says. 16 volt. You just got a oh, bigger capacity battery. Yeah. Extreme mutters. We don't see a lot of those. No. They're um, really, really affordable, especially for like the sizes you get. Is he reverse leveled? It almost looks like it, huh? Probably, yeah. Fury Country Hunter MTs. The old foam cannon shots. Decent amount of stance. Oh, his tailgate's all messed up. See how squished in there? Oh, where's he from? Texas. Texas. He's from having Look, the uh, gooseneck. He's got the big old axle dump, which is, is like it it's powder coated teal. Moose power, tow mirrors, old photos. Hashtag sitting on the toilet. You forgot that one. Uh, I wasn't gonna say it. <laughs> I can't tell if it's a Cummins or not. Probably 12 wides, 33s again. Yeah, 20, 20 by 12s, I would say. He's got. Are those like cubes behind the? Yeah, behind the grill. Behind the grill. It's kind of interesting placement. Bumper could use a little little work. Tailgate could use a little work. The teal axle dump kind of throws me off because there's no other teal anywhere on the truck, but to each their own. Got a number for it? Yeah, do it up. Okay, three, two, one, six. six. Yeah, same. I think uh, there's a couple things that could just be cleaned up on it and then it would look pretty sharp. He's got a massive windshield. Yeah, tin strip. I was just looking at that. It's, it's like huge, it's so big. Over half the windshield. It's like when Banker put the giant sticker on my car. <laughs> cover up half the windshield. You gotta like drive like this because it wasn't see-through. Or drive through because you didn't have a top on it. Yep. Drive over, look over. Yeah, that was that was the way to go. <laughs> All right, on to the next one. Big Sexy F2. Do you know this truck before I scroll to see it? Not based off, yes, I know that truck. Yeah, absolutely I was wondering massive. if it was him or not. I wasn't sure. Absolutely massive. This thing's insane. And he's a CO ambassador, huh? Yep. This thing's just crazy. I mean, grill, light bars, headlights, wheels, tires, suspension, cab lights. The mirror lights, like everything has been touched. And I believe they're 24 by 16s or something like that. They look like it. Two piece. 
and spacers, if I remember correctly. Jeez. He's got the hood done. I mean, just like every piece of this truck has been touched. And it's all murdered out other than the very small couple of chrome accents, like the badges, mirror caps, door The handles. wheels were the cleavers, right? The chrome, the black with chrome? Yeah, yep. okay. That's like the perfect wheel for that truck. Oh yeah, I think it just like goes really well with the theme he's got going. Jeez. I love the light bar in the bumper because a lot of times people do light bars and they don't look very clean, yeah. but that is how you accomplish it. Are those cleanly. stretched? Uh, it looks, well, if they're 16 wide, is they're probably a 15 inch wide. 15 and a half inch yeah. period, I would imagine. Holy Number? Yeah. Three, two, one, Eleven. Ten. Eleven. I can't find anything wrong that I, that I don't like about it. Wow. Other than I probably can't get into it. That's it. Oh, yep. Does he have side steps? Uh, not that I can tell. It doesn't look like it. Like, I don't see any power steps or anything. Wow. Next up, Miami Boosted. Oh. He's got some XF forged, the compression forged wheels from XF, and red, very bright. These headlights too, I believe those are the Morimoto headlights. Are those they? look so good. The power, like the, the F250, put, F351s, and the F151s both look really awesome. And you put the Raptor grill on the front end too? Raptor style grill. Yes. Yeah. And then it's got a pink um, custom offset sticker, which doesn't necessarily match with the red wheels, but. Maybe it's colorblind. You know, those ridge grabs. Yep. Most popular tire ever. A couple of sick rollers. Really dig those headlights and the grill. Yeah. Just, it just pulls it all together. He had, so this is the new look, but I actually, uh, this guy used to talk to me on Instagram a lot. You gotta look at the old version of it. He had it wrapped, this like military green. Yeah. Can you find a better photo than that one? No, though? no, this is the one with fuels. There, there's no more photos? Okay, there's more Yeah, photos. there's more photos, yeah. there's plenty. Wow, it's like a completely different truck. Right, like it was very, like, like theme built almost. Yeah, kind of like utilitarian style. Yeah. And then now it's just like very show truck. I wow. like the new one better than the old one, I think, which I didn't I, think I like the to. old one too though. Yeah, right, it, there's nothing wrong with it. But I would have went, um, if I was gonna do a wrap like that, I don't think I'd go with quite as wide of wheels. I'd make it more off-road yeah, looking. Yeah, go with like methods or something like that. Cause you get like the Raptor style grill and everything they had on there, but then still had 12 wides. Mm -hmm. So I would, yeah, I would go with a, a method smaller size method or something like that. I like it. So, the new one. Yep. We gotta rate that though. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, yep. mm -hmm. sure. three, yep. mm -hmm. two, one, eight. eight and a half. Took off a little bit just for the color combo of having like the pink sticker and then the red wheels and then this gray truck. There's just too many colors going on there for me. I like the gray and red, but the pink sticker just kind of throws off a little bit. Honestly, I think I would put black wheels on it. And I know that's kind of lame because everybody has yeah. black wheels, but I think it would look good, and if you want to keep the pink, pink sticker, then you could. Oh, well, yeah, at that point, yeah. Tyler O'Neill, Megatron 6.7. Look at that, it even says right in his bio, brand ambassador for custom offsets. Dang, he's good. This thing's huge. Holy. Yeah, she's big. Another one you can't get in. The old Cummins from Colorado. Don't worry, I actually know how to pronounce Colorado. You spelled it wrong. <laughs> I spelled it wrong when I said it out loud? Yeah. Got it. All blacked out, black wheels. This have to be what, 40s? I would imagine so, they're huge. They're huge. No, oh. I don't think he has. He literally has Yeah, all there we out. go, okay, perfect. 10 inch long arm kit from STS, 40 by 15 and a half uh, open countries from Toyo, and 24 by 14 fuel forged FF12s. Amp he steps. does have amp steps. Yep. So I can get in it. Yeah, well, maybe. It's still huge. Probably not. Things, things are beast. Wow. Okay. I like it. Got a number for the massive Ram. Yeah. Three, two, one, nine. nine. There's really not a lot that I can pick on other than he flipped his tow mirrors up. He doesn't <laughs> have a trailer. So we can give him some crap for that. But look at him standing under it. Yeah. The mirror is huge. At his head. Huge. I don't know how tall he is, but I'm sure I would like maybe come up to where the wheel is. <laughs> two feet tall? Yep. Closing it out with Frankie. What was this, a second gen? Move bumper on the old, the old Dodge. Second gen, 2500, Cummins. It is a Cummins? Yep. Gotta scroll through the dog pictures to find more truck pictures. Headlights, tint, windshield brow, extended cab. More dog pictures in the truck though. Yeah, I can, I can get on board with that. Oh, here's a video, what do we have? Oh, a TikTok. It's in pretty decent shape, yeah. at least based on what we can see. 
Is that a pearl paint job? I don't know. I don't know if it's just like that way in the video or if it's actually pearl. If it is pearl, that's pretty sweet. I guess it kind of looks like pearl in this photo is. too. Number for it? Yep. Three, two, one, six. Seven. It needs like some 12 wides or 14 wides. Yeah, I, I could see it. it and that, I was actually talking to her and she was saying that that's like in the works. Oh. She wants new wheels and tires, probably go bigger. And I, I think if you're gonna do a second gen, keep it as low as possible, really, really wide. They look yeah. really mean there. Cause they have those thin headlights. I think if you keep that like squatted bulldog yep. look, I think you can pull off a pretty decent build on a second gen. Definitely. So those are some of the ambassadors from the Custom Offset's ambassador list, I guess you could say. Like I said, we usually do it from the gallery. Figure we throw these guys in here for you. So if you guys are interested in signing up for it, you can, customoffsets.com forward slash ambassador. Basically, if you've got a big social media following and you'd like to be cool on the internet, we'd like to be cool with you on the internet. That's pretty good. That's a pretty good summary without getting too far into it. If you have any questions on it, just check out the website, customoffsets.com forward slash ambassador, like I said. Otherwise, uh, our normal scheduled program would be from the gallery, and you can use the gallery to figure out what fits your truck. That's what I'd usually spiel, but I don't have to tell you that now. Subscribe, youtube.com slash customoffsets.tv. <laughs> Peace.